and welcome to Add More Zest. My name's Rebecca and it's time to update my log books. Uh, so I've just been getting all my pictures etc together. So first thing I do need to do which is sort of left over from last month is the mystery two paintings that I completed. Um, I have now taken a picture of those finished. Now they are all on card for the display book. Uh, didn't, hmm, that, this washi tape had been better at not sticking, but it still managed to stick on sort of the showcase image. Um, so if you have the mystery two sets, and don't want to see them finished then stop looking now while I get this sticker stuck in and then I can tell you when to look again okay so close your eyes and I am going to I don't know whether to sort of do a bit of an angle with this do you know what I might just get rid of that one let's just keep it simple I have got my little mini dot runner while it's still got some left pop in and that's not even straight it's like if you're gonna not do it straight do it purposefully not straight <laughs> ish i think that actually looks worse than trying to be not straight so I'm trying to make sure Let's go for straight but off to the side. So mystery two now has pictures in. I've closed that up so anybody um, that didn't want to see the image, the images have now gone. Okay, so that is the end from last month. I actually haven't finished anything this month again. <laughs> I think the only thing, did I finish, is that the only thing I finished last month? I didn't even finish it last month. Uh, that was an August one that was awaiting the pictures. So I currently still have on the go uh, Mystery Abstract Ocean. I may have done one section on that. Field Memories, I've not done anything on that. Mini Safari, I might have done one. Mini Ocean, I might have to, again done one or two. I am concentrating on White Christmas. Um, I have sort of popped the others to the side and then purple tiger i can pop in here that i started it in what month are we even in in october 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 2023 so i have started that one um i've done probably a couple of sections on the bottom but I haven't finished any since and that's it for now I have finished my heaven and earth design however I don't think I even put that in my squares let me have a look did I even put it in my squares large square it will be no so I have got my two of hearts canvas but the only thing I have finished in October is my heaven and earth design. It's just not in here. So maybe I should, maybe I should try and put that in there. Do I have another logbook sheet? I don't have a picture of it finished. I've pulled out the logbook sheets that I need for this next one. I do have another one. Maybe that's what I should do. I should put that in and at least pop it in as completed because it was an epic one. It was an epic, epic, epic one. I can't believe I've not had any of my heaven and earth designs in here. So I do have my little sheet or big sheet. Um, so I'm just going to call it Little Dreamer's Tree. Little dreamers tree it is a 40 centimeters by 250 centimeters i did it on double-sided tape and it's a full drill 
I'm going to give the quality a four. It wasn't an awful canvas. It was fairly good. Uh, 239 colours. Are you ready if I get the calculator out for this one? So I'm using the calculator on my computer. So if I go 40 by times by 250 times by 16, 160,000 drills. To be honest, the tablet probably tells me exactly how many diamonds or how many stitches. Um, I didn't actually think about doing that in the first place. <sighs> Can I remember where, where I put the original chart? It's been a while since I've done this one. Is it in there? Diamond painting? Super sized little dreamer's tree. I do have it. I do have my original chart. Where is the stitches? Okay, so it actually tells me how many stitches by how many stitches. So 150 by 999. So there's actually 149,850. So let's cross that out. So 149,850. Sorry, one of my lights went out on me. I'm obviously not charged them. So I have given it a little bit of time to charge and then uh, they are currently plugged in at the minute. So hopefully that's all good. We will find out. Um, I have just changed over this one to put the number of drills correct, but it is square. It does have DMC, drill quality. I'm gonna put a three slash four, maybe let's give it a four. Um, that is because I was using my spares. So I was primarily using my spares for this project. Uh, so the chart was from Heaven and Earth Designs. Heaven and Earth Designs. Okay, now I ordered this chart. That is a good question. When did I order this chart? Does, uh, do I have an account? I'm pretty sure I do. This is where I love the fact that my computer keeps passwords for me. <laughs> for those sorts of things. So, my account, here we go. Is that, yes, that is my little super sized little dreamer's tree, max color. So I ordered this on, sorry, I have to turn the American dates into UK dates. So the 17th of April, 2019. So over four years ago, I got this. The chart was $9.50 when I purchased it. I'm pretty sure it was on an offer as well. So when did I actually start doing this one? And I'm going to figure out when I started this by my Heaven and Earth Design playlist. So, did I just put it? No. I'm trying to remember the name of the playlist. Okay, so it's called H A E D Massive Project uh, Diamond Painting 
project. Let me view that on YouTube. So four years ago, I put up the new storage. I prepared the canvas and the drills. And then I did a whip and chat. Um, and I did a join me while I start. And was that my first section? I was trying to have a look. Yes, this is back when I was working on paper. So I originally started my big project by working on paper. Now, the actual video itself doesn't actually show me it tells me that I put it up four years ago but it doesn't tell me exactly when so I'm going to have to go to my original videos and the first whip and chat I published on the 15th of May 2019 so I'm going to put time started as May 2019 because I will have filmed it around that time. I can't put the 15th because who knows if that was an exact. And I finished it in October of 2023. So over four years. Albeit, sometimes there was like a, a six-month gap of me not working on it. Um, I'm going to give the enjoyment level on this one. I'm also going to give this. Um, I'm going to give it a four, only because it wavered up and down a little bit. Um, but I am going to give the final thought of a five because I am very happy that I did this one. Um, so Little Dreamer's Tree has actually made it into my logbook, which I can't believe it never did. So let's pop Little Dreamer's Tree in. Once I do get it all laid out and get a picture of it, then I will add the picture to that one. But I'm not yet at the stage where I can lay it out where I want to. Um, I may well write a little bit about it as well. Um, but I have quite a few other ones that I need to get in to my stash, etc. so far. Because I have Artist Room, which I unboxed from Diamond Art Club. I actually haven't put our calendar painting in yet for the December event. So I have those. And I have four Paint Gem mini sets. I actually had eight arrived together, but I have four that I have unboxed. So I need to add those as well so that I have them all down and in my logbook. Paint Gem has now got its own section. Totally not surprised. <laughs> and I do actually really want to work on some more of those and get some more kitted up because I absolutely love it. Um, and if I've got any static diamonds, I now know what I'm doing with static diamonds to stop them being a pain. It's like a ha ha moment <laughs> that I actually had when um, kitting up walking in the rain, which I still need to finish. Uh, that'll actually be next week before I get to finish that just because I like to do my logbook at the beginning of the month and I need to do November's logbook at the end of, sorry, December's logbook update at the end of November because of the December event. So I didn't want to push the logbook back anymore. It would have got ridiculous. So what should we do first? So I don't have any more to add into my currently working on because I haven't finished kitting up walking in the rain yet. Um, that is going to take probably another week or two to be fully kitted up etc and that is a slow burner and um, so once white christmas is done i'll be able to go a bit more ahead with that let's pop in artist room because that's around and then i can close this book off 
I think. So artist room, artist room by, and this is Mrs. Butter D, and I'm doing my capitalization just like they have on there. So this is a 42.6 centimeters by 52.7 centimeters it's a poured glue it's a full drill number of colors i need the book i need the painting itself which is here i'm actually surprised i remembered to keep the slip out but it has 46 colors and we do have some ab's in this one so we have 46 colours. It is in round with DMC and with AB. So let's pop that one down ready to go on top of um, on top of my wardrobe. So total number of drills. So 42.6 times 52.7 times 14 because it's round and that's definitely not work let me try that again 42.6 times 52.7 times 14 oh 30 31000 430.28 but we don't need the point for this uh, this was purchased from diamond art club diamond art club let me bob over there diamond art club log into that one because this is what keeps me on track is everything that is logged in there's that order so I ordered it on the 22nd of the 8th 2023 and is my tracking still working um, Okay, apparently the connection is not private, so it's not letting me have a look. So, DHL, DHL e-commerce, and I want to track. Where can I track? Here we go. This is harder than it needs to be. Okay, it can't find details of that tracking. And I can't remember when it arrived. <laughs> so we're gonna go with September 23. Because really, once we get a year down the line, what matters because yeah so I actually paid 30 pounds 15 for this because I did use points off it but I also paid for shipping so I used points to bring price down to bring the price down because it was a bit it was the only one I wanted and if I'd have just bought the one um, it would have cost me quite a bit in shipping at the same time so I'm going to chop those two bits off and I'm going to put both stickers in here 
so that I have them when I'm putting it all together and I can decide which one I want to use. Uh, this one is classed as a large round. So this one is Diamond Art Club Artist Room. I keep adding the S because it makes sense to me to add the S. Um, I'm not actually going to put the size on that one because it's got loads of point this and point that. So I've added it in, Time and Art Club Artist Room, pop that in there and that book which is my rounds, large rounds and my specials are done. This one which is my spares, my log book for 21, 22 and 23 is done. Then I have the joys of my squares. I'm always adding to my squares. Do you not find? So let's start with paint gem. That's at the front. Now this one should be, in effect, quite a bit quicker because the details will be all the same um, in relation to delivery. So once I've got the delivery, etc will be a lot quicker. So the first one is her story. Now this is a really old, well it's an older set but I've never had it. So um, the details, so the designs for these they are 10 centimetres by 15 centimetres. It is a four piece set. Poured glue Full drill, because these do take up the full image. Number of colours is 43. Total drills, 9,600. It is square. It has DMC. Purchased from Paint Gem. Okay, date ordered. Uh, I can sign in to get this, but I do also have a separate folder for Paint Gem emails. So that is quite possibly a little bit easier. So 24th of the 9th, 2023 is when they were ordered. And they arrived on the 13th of the 10th, 2023. Um, total cost of this set is $34.90. And that's all I need for that one. So let's add it on here. Her story. 10 by 15, four pieces. And if I make sure, if I put this picture at the top, then I've still got access to the dates so that I can pinch them for my next one. And then pinch and pinch and pinch. So, her story. Number one, done, and I can scroll back up to the more recent ones now. So then we have birthstones, birthstones, the size of this one, they are 10 centimetres by 15 centimetres, though they don't take up the full canvas. Poured glue, partial drill because we don't do around the outside. Colours, 48. Total drills, 9,279. So you actually get more drills in those four than you do in this that has 12. So this has 12 pieces. And that's why some of them you get less than others. So it's square with DMC. This is the only time when I get four different kits all at once. But it can feel like it's a lot of repetitiveness and in effect it will be the next time as well. 
um, because I have another four sets to add. But luckily, I get a lot more enjoyment and a lot more time taken doing them um, than even popping them into my logbook tapes. So birthstones, let's pop that one in the middle. I've added it to this list. I've got all the details I need. So now I want geometric. Geometric. And then just scroll down so that I can get the details. So again, it's 10 centimetres, 15 centimetres. This one has 12 pieces. Poured glue. Full drill for this one because it is a full rectangle, albeit a smaller rectangle than this. It has 24 colours, which means it will go in my paint gem case, which is awesome. Uh, but this one has even less drills. This one has 14,650 square with DMC. Paint gem, 24th of September and delivered on the 13th of October. Uh, and the cost for this set is $39.90. And I did pay some towards um, most of these kits, but Paint Gem were kind enough to send me a few of them. So I'm just going to pop them all as PR ones. That's where I didn't put it, geometric. I knew I was missing a step then. 10 by 15. 15, 12 pieces. And then last, but by no means least, because there's more next month, uh, this one is Autumn Edition. Keep waiting for the other two months to come out because uh, these are absolutely gorgeous. Uh, but these are 8 by 12 centimetres, so a different size. Uh, there is 12 pieces with these, poured glue, partial drill, because we don't do all of the background, 42 colours, 12,272 drills in square with DMC, paint gem, and then copy my dates over. which will probably mean more to me a lot later on. And then the price of this one was a 39.90, though it was 49.90. It's currently sold out, but I know they are expecting more stock in of the likes of this autumn that's sold out. They are expecting more. And then we have autumn. Remember this one is a different size, eight by 12, and it's 12 pieces still. Okay, so let's pop those two paint gems in. So all I have to do really is add in the advent one. Now I have it in both round and square. I have them both down here. I've actually done both of them in round and square for the examples. I don't know which one. I thought I kept another piece of paper for this. Anyway, let's, let's get another love book sheet out. Um, I don't know which one I'm gonna do for the December events. What I think I'm gonna do is see whichever size I have the most stock of is the one I'm going to do. Um, so I'm not going to fill in everything on this straight away because I will add in dependent 
on which one I do, but I can add some of the information. So we have decided to call this um, the calendar diamond painting. So I am going to put AMZ before it. AMZ calendar. So the size will depend. They are exactly the same amount of diamonds, but there is two different sizes that they are because the rounds are bigger than the squares. They are all poured glue though, and it is full drill. Number of colours is 31. Um, so in relation to the amount of diamonds, so the square one is 41 by 36 by 16. So we have approximately 23,616 drills and that will be the same on both, roughly. Um, I'm not gonna tick whether it's round or square, it is DMC and it is from Add More Zest. Add More Zest. Um, the cost of this is the same for either and would you believe, so 27, 50 is the cost even though they are both exactly the same size and they both use exactly the same amount of diamonds even though the round one is bigger it still actually costs more for us to get in the square than it does the round does that even make sense to anybody because it doesn't make sense to me so it actually costs us more to produce the square than it does to produce the round but we charge the same for both so I'm going to leave it at that until I have decided which and I will add in which size and um, whether it's round or square. I will add those both in when I start it. I have printed off the little um, actual sort of schematic or what's actually printed on the canvas for each of them. And I have just printed out sort of the finished image for the square as well to give me choices but my washi tape has run out timing oh I do have oh I think this is the one that wasn't that good but I'm going to use it this is I just want to stick these down on here uh, I'll just print out any more images if they give me if they rip too much I'll just print some more out I'm going to use the washi tape down the side though, so hopefully it won't ruin, or if it does rip the paper, it won't rip anything important off the paper. And because I don't know which one I'm doing, I'm going to actually get ready for next month. I'm going to put it in with my currently working on stash at the back, because by the time we do the logbook next month, I will be ready to start working on this for the December event. So if you want to take part in our December event, this is the canvas I'll be doing. You don't have to do this one, uh, but it is fun um, when we all play along to the same one. So I was going to say I haven't finished a painting in October and that's quite... Mm -hmm. But I actually have finished a painting in October. I have finished my heaven and earth design. So I'm going to take that as a win. Um, hopefully in November I will finish White Christmas. Um, so that will be another big one. December, of course, I will finish the calendar. And then we'll see what next year 2024 brings after that. I've definitely got quite a few on the go, so there is a chance of me finishing more off. But that is my log books. I think they are now fully up to date, apart from the picture of my heaven and earth design completed, because I haven't yet unrolled it. Um, I'm waiting for the space. As soon as I have the space to unroll it, I will do. But I think that is everything updated. Of course, more paint gem to add at the end of the month for December but yeah 
I'm organised again. I know where I'm up to, so that'll work for me. Um, all my bits and pieces are away, so thank you all so much for joining me, and I'll speak to you all again soon.